guys and welcome to today's video. So today I have a review for you and unfortunately I don't have the products actually with me at the moment just because they were samples. But I do have a product that is like it and I have reviewed this one. So it's the John Frieda Sheer Blonde The Goat Blonder Spray. And I actually got samples for the shampoo and conditioner and they were only a one time use. And I actually used them a little bit ago but I am finally reviewing them. So it is exactly like this, it is to lighten your blonde hair, I mean I guess if you want to use this for <laughs> brunette you can, I don't know how that would work out, but you can. So they weren't very big, I mean they were probably this long and their product was maybe full with half of it, so I did get a full use of the shampoo and conditioner, and for smell wise, it smelled really good, I mean it did kind of have a little bit of a, uh, like a dye smell, just because obviously there probably was some little dye or bleach or something in it, I mean that's why it makes your hair blonder. So it did smell good, but it did have a tiny little titch of the other dye product that is in it. The shampoo was actually really nice. It lathered really good on my scalp and because I didn't shower for um, a couple days just because I usually wait, it felt really good to finally have shampoo on there as well. And so I did the shampoo and I did the conditioner. The conditioner I obviously only put on my ends because that's how I do my conditioner just because it doesn't need to be on my scalp. I ended up leaving it air dry and blow dried it. I did like half and half. I blow dried it enough so it wasn't like dripping wet but then I left it to air dry obviously so it didn't have so much heat on it and when I actually came home later that day I hung out with some of my cousins and one of them asked me if I recently dyed my hair and I have been using this one before it but I didn't use it for like two weeks beforehand so my hair wasn't really as like I guess blonde as it would be. And when I put this stuff in, apparently my hair was a lot blonder and it did look a lot blonder. I'm not sure if I have a photo. If I do, I'll insert it here somewhere. So this is the product that it is. I'm putting it somewhere up on the screen. That's what they look like. I currently don't have them because obviously they were just samples. So I was really happy when she asked me if I recently dyed my hair. I was like, no, but I did use this product and I told her how I got these samples and everything. And she's like, oh, well, you can definitely notice, which was definitely a good thing. So if I did end up wanting to use the shampoo and conditioner, I at least know it works because someone who didn't even know totally asked me about it and she was absolutely correct. A couple weeks ago, I was actually in Walmart and I saw the products in the full form and they were a little expensive. I don't know if I would buy them right now. I'm actually more happy with just using the spray just because I figured out a better way to use it and I can use it to my advantage. But I don't know if I would end up buying just the shampoo and conditioner. I'm happy with the shampoo and conditioner I'm using now. But if I do end up maybe wanting to get my hair a little more blonder in that with a shampoo or conditioner, I'm not sure which one I would choose. I mean, I use them both on different areas of my hair. So I guess I'll just kind of pick if I did. But that's it for this review. I'm sorry I actually don't have the product or anything really more to say. But if I were to rate this out of 5, I would give it a 4. The only thing that is... Well, there's two things. Is the price, I wish it was lower, so that's like half a mark that I am docking off, and kind of the smell, just how you could smell the little like perfume of the dye or bleach, whatever it actually is in it. So it is a four out of five, so I would recommend it to all you blondes that do want to go blonder. Mine did end up going, not orange, but it did end up going a little more blonde than it did a little more white, which I guess is okay and it works better for me. But if you guys definitely want to have more blonde hair, then I would definitely try getting a free sample. Or if you can, get your hands on just the spray. I got this when it was on sale, so I'm glad I did. But that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. That would be so great of you. Like, favorite, and share this video if you want to share with your friends the review on this product. And leave me a comment down below. Tell me if you have used it or if there are any other type of blonde or even maybe brunette products that are great to use to enhance your color. But that is all and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.